all I have done today so far. I'm about to get ready for the gym with Mary. And then I was going to let you guys um, kind of decorate the guest bedroom room with me. And get it all Christmassy for when people start coming in for the holidays. My aunt, my uncle, my brother-in-law, some of his friends. So we never know who's going to need a bed and when they're going to need a bed. And I definitely want them to feel like warm and welcome if they come and stay in the room. So we'll get that set up. And yeah, Finley says good morning. Well, good afternoon at this point. We are almost officially done with my schoolwork. I've been writing a research paper that I waited until the very last minute to start. So I got up at 7.30 when Dylan left for work this morning and I look disgusting. And just kind of tackled that. It's about 1.15 right now and I'm pretty much done. I just gotta do the little introduction paragraph like explaining my whole paper. And then my references, which those are done too. But that's all I've done this morning. Not really eventful whatsoever. Hope you guys are having. I'm going to put on a little bit of tinted moisturizer and maybe some mascara. And then I'll probably just wear a clip today because we're not doing any kind of cardio. And it's just arms and abs. So nothing too crazy today. Also, if you don't wear dailies. I literally have no idea how you get those thick monthly or weekly or whatever other options they have in your eyes. They fall out of mine. Even these fall out of mine, but these are the only ones that I can actually like withhold the whole day. This is the hair. Another thing about me is when I get to the gym is I like to wear like a big oversized hoodie so I can get my grind on kind of like it's like a head down I'm grinding out kind of vibes so yeah so you'll always catch me in the gym with a big hoodie on usually if not maybe like an oversized t-shirt just have like a uh, belly blubber that I'm not confident about so that's why and I have a better workout with this on so guess what I'm gonna wear it Got the energy drinks and on the way to pick up Mary Lou and then we'll go to the gym like actually really excited to get there today just been literally sitting on my chair and a half today writing that research paper so anything I don't know why that was like yelling at me it wasn't close to anything so anything to do outside of the house today for the rest of the day, I'm super excited. We were supposed to be at the gym at 3, but I wanted to finish that last little paragraph I had. So we'll leave at 3. But like Mary said, she cannot complain because her track record of being on time, her list of being on time is very small. <laughs> Vibes. Going to the gym. <laughs> We're going to the gym. We're about to make a little jingle. <laughs> My dad said, you look like a ninja. <laughs> oh, like golden an hour. hour. It still looks good. It's a vibe. Looks like you have a, like the Dyson air wrap for this. I How wish. did you do that? Um, Honestly, just like, like curling. Thing. Like a normal curling like hair? Clamp, like yeah. a wand. A clamp. Oh. I'll be doing it like the hairstyle. You know, they go. Yeah. I'll do that. I knew how to do that. I tried it. Okay. Okay. I got you watermelon because you didn't get to try the watermelon last time. Okay. But if you want the apple sparkling Fuji pear, you can have that one as well. Um, is the watermelon good? Yeah. I'll try the watermelon. Okay. I have you had the Alani Witch's Brew one? No. Is it good? Yeah. It's like, do you like you like apple stuff? Yeah. It's like it's like um not sour apple, but like apple. Oh. Let's crack it at the same time. 
One, two, three. Dang it, we weren't on I'm not very good at it. Okay. Mary is on her third treadmill because she broke this one <laughs> and this one with her little Bluetooth watch. <laughs> Mary texted me when she's right next to me. eating there we're gonna head home and eat um dinner just at the house but i got a cold cut combo i'll show you guys in just a second what did you get babe the italian number 20. what is that don't really know is it like the meatball thing you get what is it what is it <laughs> i just want to know what it is <laughs> what kind of meat is on it chicken you guys, also my throat is killing me. I don't know what it is, and I really hope I'm not getting sick, but it literally feels like when it's like closing in and you can't swallow. I already gar gargled with salt water, so I don't know what else to do. What your sandwiches. Show me your sandwich. You remember the meat yet? Chicken. <laughs> So we are re, not redoing, I want to decorate um, our guest bedroom and these are the sheets that I bought. They're a flannel set from Target. They just got a cute little deer, snowflake, very like woodsy country vibes um, and this tree on it. But it was a heavyweight flannel, full sheet set, soft fabric, stay warm and cozy, brushed for a softer feel and then easy care machine washable. So 100% Turkish cotton. We're also going to wash the sheets before we put them on. So let me put them in right now. Let's go outside. The snow is falling down and every child is having so much fun. The snowman is twice the size as me with a smile as quirky as mine We're holding hands to keep each other warm while we stand And watch a choir performing all the Christmas songs that we love Yeah, all the Christmas songs that we love And then while we're gonna go inside and drink our chocolate by the fire Cause all I want is to spend this day with you let me give you a Christmas A moment we'll fill with love and joy mm -mm, So beautiful, kissing on a mistletoe baby, with you I don't need any presents As long as I 
comforter on and I did a one little fold back to make it look like a ruffle at the end of the bed. This is the little tray that I just add. It's usually got a book, some sort of candle, and then I, I need to find like a trinket or um, a little dish that's kind of Christmassy to bring in the vibes and put candy in. But you guys, this was sitting up here earlier. The whole tray was sitting right here. I'm about to decorate this and show you guys. But this was sitting on the tray, and I had just lit one of my Bath & Body Works candles, and it started popping everywhere, and I was like, no! I was like shielding with the little metal lid that comes with it, and I turn around to grab the lighter, and this is in flames. Like, not, like, I know it's like kind of hard to show, but like the flame was up here. Like, what if it got caught onto that tree right there? I would have been in a mess. So, pay attention to your candles. And here's proof I almost burnt our house down. I also got this piece from Walmart. It is the brand My Texas House. It's her line that she did like a collab with Walmart for. And it's a candle holder. I think it's so cute. It's kind of a staple. It's neutral. I feel like that won't get old. But I think it looks good up there. Also adding this little um, Let Heaven and Nature Sing sign. It's kind of like the clay material. I feel like that could easily break. This was like $6 from Walmart as well. But I feel like that's a good neutral as well. And it is timeless. Okay guys, enough of me just babbling and doing random stuff in this video. I wanted to show you my newly December haul. Sorry, I have a cough drop in my mouth because... This sore throat is killing me. Anyways, I wanted to show you guys what I ordered from Newly for, for what I ordered from Newly for my December subscription. And these I can't wait to show you guys. And I hope I can fit them. The last few I've like not been able to fit. These actually look pretty short, so I don't know. We'll see. But they're like red velvet jeans. They're by Anthropology. And they've just got like the nice high and deep pocket. And they have like faux back pockets. The material, I don't know if you guys can see that up close. But it's like I really hope I can make these work. Because they are such a vibe for like New York City Christmas pictures. So I hope these work. I really hope those work. Next I got for possibly my family's Christmas I definitely need to steam these and then maybe I can wear like a tucked in bodysuit or something but they're more of like a linen-y softer muted red. They have faux pockets on the back as well, none on the front but it's supposed to have like that pleated look right here and once I iron it and steam it it'll, it'll have the full look but I think these are so cute and also comfy for a day filled with family gatherings and hanging out and games and all the stuff this pair I thought would be a classic to have in New York it's like a almost like a cropped black pair straight leg denim this is by the brand anthropology as well let me see what these last ones were I didn't say the brand this is free people the linen pants were free people and these black jeans are which these have a lot of stretch so I'm pretty sure I'll be able to wear these um anthropology they got pockets on the front and the back it's kind of like a 
straight across. It's no divots or anything. I don't know if you can see them this material close, but it's pretty good as well. Excited to wear that. I can just be like for one of the bar nights. And then I got these jeans for all the family function gatherings we will be having for Christmas and all the friend things we will be doing. This has got a narrow waist, so I doubt I can wear these, but we will see. The tag's literally never been off of these. This is free people as well as well. I was really into like the straight a lot straight across top, like no kind of divot anything. It's got a few little pleated lines at the top. There's the material for reference. It's very jean type with a little bell bottom flare. Not too much though. And it's like a dark can't really tell in this lighting, but it's like a deep green. I think they're very festive. Hopefully I can fit into them because they are, they look little. <laughs> and then I have this sweater. I thought it would just be a good classic to have during the holidays. I can pair with the green jeans or the black jeans or the red jeans. Um, this is Anthropology. And it just is so, so cute. It's just a tan and it kind of comes in a little bit at the waist and then flares back out at the bottom. And it's got these little buttons for detail. They're really pretty. It's not itchy, it feels really soft. So I think that was a good choice as well. And then my favorite, the one that I'm most excited for is this hot, or it's like a baby pink actually. I wanted a hot pink, but I couldn't find a hot pink in my size and availability. So I just went with this baby pink and I'm probably gonna wear it with my new Dairy Boy uh, jeans, the light wash with like a white tank underneath because I don't like pink and black together at, like at all. But this I wanna wear to the Gals on the Go podcast that we're going to see like their live show in December in New York at the town hall so I'm super excited it has these gold details so I'll probably wear gold jewelry with this and it's like a rolled up sleeve and it kind of cuffs right there of course it's got the classic collar for a blazer and some faux pocket oh no those are real pockets real pockets on this blazer down at the bottom with the same color lining of that all folk same color lining That definitely needs to be steamed too, but I think this is a huge win. As long as those pants fit, we'll see. <laughs> but I just wanted to end off the vlog here as well and wish you guys a Merry Christmas again for the fifth time this month. Um, I hope you really are diving into the Christmas activities with your family and friends and really enjoying this season. You never know when it's your last. And yeah, um... I don't really have anything for you to comment this time because I was literally doing my research paper the whole time. If you want to see more workout videos or more like home decorating videos, let me know. Those are like my two kind of niches that I like the most. Um, but yeah, hope you guys are having a great holiday season like I already said. And thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe and see you guys in the next one. Bye.